Hello, in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you're going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So I don't want you to use your calculator and here is the problem. We have 1 plus 1 times 1 divided by 1 and plus 1. Very simple numbers like 1, only 1, division, uh, addition and, uh, and uh, multiplication right here. So of course many of you are like, there, yes, I can handle this. This is basic addition, multiplication and division. So I don't want you to write your option in a comment. What do you think about the correct? answer. Because obviously whatever order you select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct answer to do this to do this problem, what is the correct order of operation. And then I show to my students, because a lot of students do this common mistake, right here we have PMDMC order and let's look to our problem. So right here we have only one, only addition, multiplication and division. And let's look to our order of operations. So right here, first step, we have parentheses, yeah? And let's look, look to our problem. Do we have parentheses right here? No, I don't see any, any parentheses. I don't see any of those. We don't have any parentheses. What about, what about exponents right here? So do we have exponents? Uh, I don't see any exponent. No squares, no cubes, no fourth power. So it's really great. So we just keep this two steps because PMDMC goes from the top to the bottom. So we first do parentheses, then exponent, then multiplication division as one group, and then addition and subtraction as another group. Yeah. So we just skip these parentheses and the exponent part, which is really great. And we go next. We have multiplication. But one really important moment, we need to work with multiplication and division as one group. Yeah. So it's not like first multiplication, then division. It can be like division, then multiplication. So we need to see multiplication and division group. Yeah. So we have one. I write right here once more this question. So one plus one times one dividing by one and plus one. Yeah. So we skip first two steps and then we go multiplication and division parts from left to right. Right here, first step plus. So we don't have multiplication division part. Then we have multiplication and then we have division. So we need to start with this with this part at first multiplication and division part. OK, and right now we see what the first sign we see with the multiplication. So we start with this multiplication. One times one, we start with this multiplication equal to one. And then we have division. Yeah, so divided by one. We can easily find it. So one divided by one equal to equal to one. So the first step multiplication and division part is equal to one. So this equal to one. And then what we still have, we still have one from the beginning. We have one in, in our this part plus one and plus one in the end. So one plus one plus one equal to equal to three. And three is a correct answer. A lot of students do this common mistake. They start with this addition. So one plus one equal to two, two times one, two right here too. So as you can see, the same three if it goes like in a wrong way. Yeah. But if you want, if you want to solve it correctly, step by step with PMDMC order, we need to solve it in this, in this way. Okay, so definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. Now, if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, if you're struggling with basic math or like pre-algebra concept, you can easily subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematics adventure. Thank you for your time and have a great day.